Hey. Oh. Was there any trepidation at doing a remake? Of course, absolutely. Absolutely, trepidation. Let's face it, remakes make people angry. And as an individual, I don't like people being angry at me. As a filmmaker, I don't like people being angry at me. But it's also, there is a difference between Night of the Demons and Halloween. There is a difference between Night of the Demons and Night of the Living Dead. There is a demons difference between Night of the Demons and Dawn of the Dead. So I figured if I was going to remake a movie, Night of the Demons seemed like a pretty safe one to do. Uh, what do you think about the whole the current trend of the, this? The strip mine in the 80s at the minute for remakes. It's you know it's the it's the business. People want recognizable titles. That's how they can finance them. That's how they can give you money to make these movies. And so as filmmakers, we can, as much as I think, and I'm all in favor of original, homegrown, comes from screenplays, uh, not books, not comic books, not other films. The fact of the matter is this is the trend. Um, uh, this is the trend that's going. And if I want to pay my mortgage, I have to follow the trend to a certain degree. I just have to be able to put as much stuff in it that's me as I can. Well then, you say, you know, like the remakes, they have a recognizable name, and then somebody goes and makes something original, like we saw Trick or Treat the other night, yes. and then they sit on it. Yes, and that's exactly what happens, and that's why it's so fucking sad. Yeah. It's like, you know, I mean, last year I had a movie called Autopsy came out. Totally original, not like... Not, not like any, not like really like anything else, and nobody paid much attention to Autopsy. It got, it sold some on video. It, it, it in the theaters. It came out in America and did okay. But I've gotten more questions and more press for this movie than I ever did for the original one. That is not right. We, you know, it's not. And and my next movie is original. I can, I'm, I'm bound by contract not to mention anything about what it is. But it is. But I'm, but like I said, you know, every time you take a story from a book, it's not original. Every time you take a story from a comic book, it certainly isn't original. And this has been going on for years. I mean, even if, I mean, not to get too high balloon, but Shakespeare didn't make up half of his stories. They were around too. So it's it's part of tradition. Dracula and Frankenstein have been remade over and over again from 1922 Nosferatu to 1931 to Christopher Lee to Coppola to you know everything it's a, it's, it's a tradition in horror movies if you respect the genre and love the genre and real and, and are doing it for other reasons than just to make a buck you yeah. should be able to do good one, one final question okay, yeah. the audition process for the female cast was it based on bra size no <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll <live. laughs> Thank you.